This is the Realme C33 and today we would like to demonstrate that you can set up the parental controls feature on this device. So to begin with, uh, you gotta launch settings, then enter the Google category. In here, if there are any, uh, well, Google accounts linked and associated with the smartphone, you gotta remove them. You can do that by tapping over here, then go in for the manage accounts on this device option open in the account synchronization page and tap on the remove account button. Now once uh, well, there are no accounts logged into on this device, go for the parental controls, then get started, child routine, next. Now we'll have to wait for a little bit. In here, tap on the add or create account for your child, respectively, if you already have an account prepared to just uh, sign in. If the, you do not have the child's Google account yet, just tap on the create account option. So I myself do have the Google account prepared, so I'll enter, first of all, the email for it. Then the password. After that, I agree. We'll wait for the Google services to get loaded. Tap on the accept button. Choose the account that we have just logged into from the list. Then on the, this page, you have to enter the credentials for the parents account or for the account, the Google account that you will use as for like supervising your child's activity. So I will quickly do exactly that. <coughs> In here you can learn more about supervision, what feature and options and possibilities it provides you with. Then scroll the page all the way down. You will not have any near as many devices as I do. You, actually, I would be surprised if you have any uh, at all. Next, in order to confirm the uh, link-in procedure between the child's and parent's account, enter the uh, well password to the child's Google account once again. Then tap on the agree button at the bottom right corner. Then you'll get this pop-up uh, window where you want to choose the allow option on. Then wait until those accounts will be linked. Then next, you can in here you can turn on or turn off the apps that you want your child to use or not use respectively. Uh, if, if you are not ready to do that just yet, do not worry. You'll be able to manage uh, apps later on as well. So you can just skip it. Skip this step, I mean, do not do anything at all. Then the same goes and applies for the filters and content restrictions. In here, uh, well, see if uh, the device that is written in the bold font bold phone is the one that you will be use uh, that you will be using for supervising your child if it is uh, the right device tap on this button blue one if it is not just skip and uh, later install the family link application manually you can get it for free uh, at the play store in my case it is the exact device that i was planning to use so i'll tap on the blue install family link button in here on my Redmi device, the installation process of this app has been successfully initiated, started, and now is approaching its finish. So we will wait for it to be finalized. Here you can click on next, and that means that uh, on the child's end everything is set, the parental controls are active. Now just take the supervisor's device, or the device that you will use for supervising your child's activity, Open the family link app that you have uh, presumably downloaded and installed. In here, make sure to choose the uh, parents account that you have pointed out earlier while setting up the feature feature on the child smartphone or teen smartphone, whatever. And in here, you'll find the device. Here it is, Realme C33. You can monitor and configure the daily limits, daily limits or set them, should I rather say. 
uh, you can uh, set the downtime for child's phone to be inactive between I mean in then configure and set app limits as well as monitor the uh, app activity apply content restrictions configure account settings and manage devices already so that would be it as far as setting up the parental control feature or family link on realme c33 goes we highly appreciate you watching us thanks for your attention and bye bye